A Vacaville teacher, Rodney Orozco, whose picture is on your screen, turns himself in to police. He is accused of kissing a female student and leaving text messages on her phone. He is not the only Vacaville teacher in custody. Within 24 hours of his arrest, another Vacaville teacher gets picked up by police. Bobby Chambers allegedly had weapons, ammunition, and drugs in his car. As Crown Force Teresa Asasio reports, some people in the Vacaville community are reeling from these cases. Here at Vacaville High School, where teacher Rodney Orozco, the man accused of lewdness with a minor, teaches, most parents and students had mixed emotions about his arrest. Most parents tell Cron4 News that they are very shocked, defending the teacher, saying that he is a very good instructor. Many had their son and daughter in one of Orozco's classes. He also teaches drama and oversees school plays. Most parents wouldn't talk on camera, but this parent did say that he is angry about the allegations. What were your thoughts when you heard about the arrest of this English teacher? Well, I thought so that guy was way out of pocket for what he did. Should have never messed with that little young girl. Not at all. I mean, girls, what, under 18? It's not a good thing, especially in the school. It guys, makes me scared. I want my daughter to go to this school now. He also added that he's upset about the arrest of a middle school teacher, Bobby Chambers, who was taken into custody Thursday afternoon after police found drugs and a gun in his car. Bringing drugs and guns to school, we're trying to keep it out to school, we're trying to keep kids from getting into that, and for a teacher to come and bring that into school, it's like contradicting what we're trying to do. Kind of scratch your head about what's going on here? Yeah, definitely. I mean, this stuff wasn't going on when I went to school here, so I don't know what's going on now. In Vacaville, Teresa Estacio, Cron4 News.